Hey, hi everyone. Uh, so in this video, I'm going to give one amazing tip for the page navigation. Okay. So normally everyone knows the page navigation, like uh, uh, giving a uh, blank buttons. Okay. Giving blank buttons and then move the navigation. So this is, everyone knows that. So just giving the page name. So like whatever the page you want to move so that uh, we'll take the name and then, okay. So we'll, you know, uh, fill that. Uh, okay. So this, everyone knows this. Okay. Just uh, go to, uh, you know, um, this uh, style and then, uh, you know, make the text and then make it this page and then we'll apply the page navigation. So action. And then in the action, we'll apply the page navigation. Everyone knows this. Okay. This is the normal one, but I'm going to uh, give a, you know, uh, different page navigation, guys. Okay, different page navigation. I'm not going to apply this one. Okay. Suppose if you click on this, so it will move to the page navigation. So page two, but I don't, okay. I'm not going to give that. Okay. I'm going to give, I'm going to give like this. Okay. So like uh, slices, suppose, uh, you have a page like this and uh, so if you select the page uh, one and then go button click go button so like this okay uh, slicer so we'll give the slices and then button okay so it's a help of slices and buttons so just click here and then go so you want to know these things okay just uh, okay let me go to this report okay let me go to this report and here you have to create one disconnected table like so with the page names okay with the page names uh, you have to create one custom table so i'm going with the you know uh, table name like uh, pages okay it's so pages and then so the page what we have page one and page two it's a case sensitive and also the same pages names you have okay so whatever the page you have the same pages name you should have okay otherwise it will not work okay page two and then page three Okay, so this we have to create and this uh, we can say, uh, okay, we, I, will, we, I will keep as this case, okay, I will keep as this and then load, and then load. Okay, now, so even that one also created, so we'll go to the, so this page, sorry, not here, sorry, here, right, so, yeah. So we have created, now we'll go and select these pages and then take a slicer, take a slicer. And uh, so go with the drop down, go with the drop down. And uh, after that, you have to go with the settings, uh, slicer settings, and then a uh, single selection. Okay, single selection. And uh, insert the button, okay, go button. So whatever the button, so you can download from your, you know, so this, uh, so you can search like go uh, photo download something like that. You can search and then you can take that from the. You can save it, uh, save as a uh, save as image. Okay, copy as image or save as image. You can take that and then. So I have saved in my desktop. So just I'm bringing that. Okay, go to insert tab. Okay, just browse the image. And go to you no know, desktop. And then this is my image. So you can, you know, reshape it, minimize it. And uh, again, you can, uh, know. so you can uh, shape it like this. So if you want, um, so some more size, yeah. Like this, you can keep. Um, now, not, now what we have to do, we have to enable the action on this. So this time we are going with the, so page navigation action, right? So page navigation action. So the destination should be in a conditional formatting. So you have to uh, select this FX, okay, FX, and then uh, select this table and then pages, the first page, okay, summarization is the first page and then click OK. Now, uh, if you select any pages, okay, just to select page three and then click here. So it will take you to the page three, right, guys? So do you feel? Like, so if you go to the page two and then click go, so it will take you to the page two. So this is all about the tips for today, guys. Okay, hope you like the video. Uh, so if you watch my video first time, so hit the subscribe button and for more videos, guys. Okay, thank you so much uh, uh, for your uh, you know, support and all that. Thank you, guys. Okay, so we'll catch up for the next video.